Let's start the video. For the old film effect, I have placed three clips on my timeline. In the project panel, click on the adjustment layer and drag it onto the video clips. Adjust the length of the adjustment layer to match the length of the video clips. Then click on the adjustment layer. After that, go to the window menu and check Lumetri color. Then in Lumetri color, set the contrast value to megas 25, shadows and whites to 29.3, and blacks to 25. Next, go to the creative tab and set the vibrance value to 60.2. Then go to the Effects panel, search for Gaussian Blur and double-click it. After that, search for Noise and double-click it as well. Set the blurriness value to 6 and the amount of noise value to 24. I'm zooming in to 100% so you can see the noise effect applied. After that, drag the old screen filter from your project panel onto the timeline. Its scale is small, so I'll set it to 200%. Then set the Blend Mode to Screen. After that, drag the old screen frame from your project panel onto the timeline and all of this is available on YouTube. I'll set its scale to 200% as well. Then go to the Effects panel, search for Ultra Key, and double-click on it. Then, click on the Color tool and select the green color from the screen, which will make your video appear within the frame. Before viewing the video, go to the Sequence menu and select Render In to Out. The video is ready. For more videos like this, subscribe to my channel, and don't forget to hit the bell icon to get notified about future uploads. Thank you for watching the video. Goodbye.